tired of talking about it and ready to go out there and see what we got. Um, you know, offense, defense, special teams uh, is exciting for me. I think uh, we've improved a great deal over the last month um, in, in really all aspects. Uh, we certainly have a long way to go, but that's what the, the journey's really all about is, uh, is seeing how much you can progress, and that's really what it's about. Uh, and I think this team will be one that uh, will get better consistently because we are relatively young in some areas, but uh, again, we have a, a lot of experience in other areas, so it's it's unique uh, team. Uh, this this team will consist of, you know, for the most part, I think we have 24 true freshmen or redshirt freshmen, so it's a, a little bit of a transition with uh, a real stable group of, of senior leaders. So. Uh, I like that. Uh, I like that combination. Uh, I think it, it works well uh, because we have such strong, uh, such a strong group of, of seniors and and really guys that played a lot of big big time football games for us. So there is a little bit of uh, inexperience, but uh, again, I think we we have experience in, in critical elements to our team that uh, that that help that inexperience and that youth uh, transition. Uh, and how much we have to use a lot of that youth will be determined, obviously, as we continue to go. Obviously, the, the youth movement's a little bit, um, you know, more than we would like, but uh, that's just due to, you know, uh, 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 you know, a rash of injuries that put us in this situation where we've had to rely more on our depth than we have in the past. But, uh, again, I don't... I don't look at that as, uh, again, that's going to help your team in, in the long run. And uh, I believe all the players that have been injured will be back stronger than they were prior to their injuries. So, um, you know, it's kind of a unique uh, situation. Uh, but, uh, you know, Northern Arizona is a, you know, Jerome has done a great job. I think with that team, uh, obviously, I, I think as the state gets better, I think his teams will continually have improved. Uh, I think. Uh, you know, watching them play at Arizona State and watching them play us, you know, they, they look forward to this game in, in a lot of ways. Um, it's, a, it's a huge opportunity for them to, um, you know, showcase their program. Um, you know, you watch them compete and they compete. The thing I notice is they compete every time they step on the field. I think they lost, oh, shoot, three or four games in the last uh, minute, maybe a um, minute, minute and a half last year had – Great opportunity to beat the national champs, Eastern Washington at Eastern Washington, and played a great game. Really turned the ball over, uncharacteristic uh, of them, uh, but had a great opportunity to win that game on the road in a, in a tough place to play against a really good football team. So they, they're they well coached. Uh, their kids play extremely hard. I, I, I like the way they play, and their systems are, are very complete. Uh, they're very foolproof. Um, uh, and, uh, you know, they're good players. They have uh, a couple guys that, you know, stand out, uh, you know, a skilled receiver or two. And, you know, that, you know, these guys can play, you know, they can play, you know, with the best of them. So they got some playmakers on offense that you have to be aware of. You know, the running back, the big kid, is, is a guy that we, you know, we really worked hard at. So, um, you know, he's a, he's a very complete player. He comes from a good program here in the state. So I'm sure he'll be you know, chopping at the bit to come down here and uh, prove himself. So uh, we have to be prepared, and uh, this team has, you know, has competed with us every time we stepped on the field with them. We, we know what they're capable of.